Hi church, it's Julie here and I'm on the patio in my backyard and just meeting with some ministry leaders today uh, because we want to talk about today what's going on in the church and we've been praying and discerning and just really listening to God to, to know what it is that we're supposed to do. Here's what we know. We know that the mission hasn't changed, that we're still called to carry out the Great Commission, to reach the lost, to build people into being closer followers of Jesus. And so we're asking a lot of questions and you're asking a lot of questions. We've been talking today about things like, um, what do we do with our kids to make them feel safe when we start bringing kids back into church? We're talking about what do we do to help people engage online? We know it's hard when you've got little kids at home. We know it's hard when you've got, uh, maybe you're a single parent. We're asking things like, what do we do about all of the, the tension, the disharmony that's in our world today? And how do we talk and, and address things in, in the world, in our community, like uh, financial stress, maybe emotional stress, maybe marriage uh, stress, and spiritual uh, health. So these are all things that are, have been on our lips as we're continuing to talk about what it looks like to be a digital world, but also what it looks like to be on site and get back into the church. You know, it seems so complicated. And I feel for you because I've got kids who have kids and they're talking about school being changed this fall. They're talking about vacations that have been canceled. And so we just wanna be there to support you. So here's what we need from you today. Um, we need you to pray for us because this is hard work. We need you to um, be an encouragement and we need you to offer grace. We also need you to tell us if you've got some ideas because we feel like we have kind of a pulse, our finger on a, the pulse of what's going on, but we want to hear from you. So if you've got ideas, you might send them our way. And then we hope that you will invite people. So maybe it's being a part of the service at 8.30 or 10.30 online, inviting some family, some friends, some neighbors over. Maybe it's being on site and worshiping with us on site. Maybe it's stepping into volunteering. Maybe you need to start your own group. Maybe you've been having dialogue about Jesus with some of your friends and you could start a group online or get together at a coffee shop or something like that. But ask yourselves, what can I do? God, what can I do to continue to grow spiritually, to continue to connect with others and to be a part of things here at The Ridge. We hope to see you this week.